So today I've got my hands on the brand new XL Van Q7 World Cup projector. Now this is a 720p native LED video projector, energy efficiency is 70 watts, lamp life is 20,000 hours, brightness is 200 ANSI lumens, you've got a native resolution of 1280 by 800, you've got HDMI inputs, contrast ratio 1000 to 1, screen size up to 160 inches and noise level is around 22 to 28 decibels. So this is everything you get in the box beginning with a user manual. You've also got a warranty card and a quick user guide. Now this comes with an HDMI cable, a power adapter, a VGA cable, and you also get an old school AV connection, things like your VCRs, PlayStation 2, um, any other camcorders, old camcorders and stuff like that. So it's nice to see that they included this cable. It could be useful for some people. And last but not least, the XL Van World Cup projector. So here it is. Now, they're not just calling it a World Cup projector for fun. If you look over here, you can see a logo engraved 2018 Russia with a logo there of the World Cup. Very, very nice design. I have to say, finished in white. Um, in my opinion, white and silver always looks very nice. And you've got a silver aluminium top. Over here, you have your focus adjustment and your lens on the front. Now, the lens, you've got a lens cap, which comes off. And this part of the lens is also finished in chrome and it's made out of metal. So very impressed with the design so far. I have to say, not only does it look nice, but it feels pretty premium. It feels and looks uh, very premium. Now onto the ports, you've got ventilation on the front. On the side, you've got more ventilation. And on the back of the projector, you have your power socket, two USB ports, two HDMI ports, an AV port, headphone jack, and also a VGA port. So you can play movies from your USB drives. You can also plug in any HDMI device, such as your PlayStation, your Xbox, your tablet, smartphone, um, virtually any device that's got an HDMI connection, you can plug into here and enjoy it on the big screen. So you have a 3.5 mil audio jack over here, so you can attach your headphones or even a speaker system. You've got an infrared port here for the remote control, so here is the remote control and you'll be able to control all functions from this remote as you can see. Also if we just tilt the projector down a bit you will see you've got a whole load of operational buttons over here so you can actually control everything from here. If you didn't want to use the remote you've got a secondary option over here. Now if we keep going there is nothing on this side you've just got grills and also what appears to be a round speaker grill. And that brings us back to the front of the projector. So if we just flip it over this is what the bottom of the projector looks like. You've got an elevation kickstand here, which is always quite handy to have. Um, if you peel back these um, foam stickers or rubber stickers, it will expose your tripod screws. So you've got four of them there. You'll have four tripod screws and you'll be able to mount this projector to the ceiling with a ceiling mount. Watching the World Cup on this, that's what we're going to be doing in the, in the demonstration coming up. So without further ado, Let's get this all connected up and find out how good this projector really is. I'll be right back. So I've got the projector on and as you can see, we've got a 100 inch screen on that wall. We are projecting around three meters away. I have got my fire stick attached to this. So that's what we're going to be testing out, the fire stick via HDMI. So this is the regular screen you get when you power up. And as you can see, the clarity is very good. Now I will switch on the light to give you guys a quick idea of what to expect. So that is the image with the light on. Still, image is very clear. Colors are still vibrant. And with the light off, it's absolutely amazing. So let's go ahead and test out a few film trailers. So here is the fire stick all connected up. Two seconds later, they've now lost the ball. She got the subcurte, licking tigers 
better shikari. Going in Hikarta. I was wondering if you wouldn't mind transporting something for me. No questions asked. Why not? In between the two defenders, one touch. Goalkeeper made the decision to cut. Guerrero's ball across. It's Carrillo! And finds its voice. Their first goal of the two... Beyond the battle. So there you have it guys, that was the new XL Van Q7 World Cup projector. And here is my top performing LED projector chart of 2018, showing you what's the latest and greatest in projectors and letting you compare the specs and prices. Now based on my experience with this projector, it has ranked number four on this chart. Now I love that this projector is compact in size and looks and feels very premium. You have a 720p native resolution with 200 ANSI lumens, which gives you a very nice cinema-like projection in your home. The built-in speakers provide a loud and clear sound in fact, this could be one of the better sounding projectors I have heard in a while. You have lots of expansion and many ways to connect to this projector. Bottom line, a great all-round projector in a compact size, very enjoyable to watch the World Cup, movies, TV shows and my favourite, big screen gaming. So I absolutely love my PlayStation 4 on a 100 inch screen and this projector lets you do it in style. And with that being said, I will leave the links in the description so you guys can check this product out. And if you like it, you can of course go ahead and pick one up for yourself. That's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. See you in the next one guys.